What's up, guys? I thought I would throw this little video together and show you guys how I've been making my gate panels uh, in case somebody wants to give it a whirl themselves. Uh, let's see if I can put a link for this fabric. I've been getting it off eBay. Basically, one order of fabric and the rest of the stuff. You end up with two 5x5 five five gates for about, I'd say about 50 bucks if you build them out of PVC and whatnot. Um, so what I'm using for glue, you can get it at Home Depot. It's shower pan liner adhesive. It's kind of like a rubber cement, like a contact adhesive. I try and hit it quick. I don't let it dry that long because it's really tacky. Um, the biggest thing that made this easier for me is this template here. I took a, like a eighth inch sheet of plywood and made up this template. So I've got my lines where I'm gonna glue and I've got my lines where I'm gonna fold. Uh, these are the corners that I cut out for the top panels. I've got a mark where I lay this down and I cut the length for the five foot sides. Then another mark over here for a five foot top. So I can lay the stuff out and get it cut up. And uh, you know, the glue lines especially, cause you can see right through the fabric, you can lay it over, you can run the glue where it belongs. So I'll make up a, uh, a top panel and see how this video comes out. Definitely want some rubber gloves. I go through about one pair for every one or two panels that I make up. So I'll see how that works. I laid these out this morning, so I've already got the corners cut. The original ones I did, you know, I did a lot more elaborate where I was folding inside itself and all that, but believe it or not, the stuff holds up really well. Uh, and you can actually make band-aids if you do damage something with the straps. And it cures pretty quick. Um, I use brass grommets in these. You can buy that set for uh, putting the brass grommets in at Home Depot also. Ten times easier to do it in a vise. Something like that helps with the pipe or something to get that fold. See right through this template so I know where my roughly where my glue lines need to be. I originally did this with one inch PVC. I'm going a three-quarter EMT. I've done a you know a spec size gravity gate with it. Uh, it's, it's done pretty well. I make the openings pretty large so it's real easy to fit the pipes through and uh, really has no bad side effect. You can see it's already tacked up there. Personally, because I build uh, at a field, so we have full-time courses out there, and I have the pleasure of building, funding, and designing the courses on one section. And uh, personally, I kind of like having the plain white panels. You know, I'm not big on the sponsorship logos and all that, me personally, but that's a whole other story. Don't need to do you know, you can leave it a little dry in the in the fold portion, but definitely want to get a good amount where the rivets are going to be. But 
But out in the middle, you know, it's it's not critical that the fold the fold can open up a little bit at the fold. If you know what I mean, the seam will be tight. But as you actually go through quite a bit of glue, even with it on the plywood, you lose quite a bit. It's like eight bucks a can of glue. You know, and you get, I forget how much I was getting out of these. It's been a little while. Basically, not much more than a gate. It's going to be. biggest thing with this stuff was uh you know trying to figure out how to six stitch it or whatever but i'm telling you this glue is awesome for this do need to let it tack up just a bit so it doesn't lift after the fact. <clears throat> I'm sure you can do your own math and figure out the sizes and all that. Uh, basically what I figure for the overlap, I figure about an inch and a half on the seams. And so basically from this edge to the fold, I got about four and a half to five inches. So from here to there is about 10 inches. Most, I think it's like nine and a half. Same with on the top. And that leaves a ton of room there. You can see that's a three quarter EMT, but you know, it's, there's no harm in having that opening a lot bigger. them over the raptor, rafters, let those cure up, and then tomorrow morning I'll punch the grommets in them and go build a couple more gates for my course there. So hopefully that helps somebody, or at least takes a little bit of the pain out of doing this, but uh, they do really hold up well. 